Thank you, Sam. Our nine overtime high school football previews roll on today as well here in El Paso with the East Lake Falcons. They've made the playoffs every year that Ruben Rodriguez has been the head coach. They're looking to do it again in his fifth year at the helm. East Lake will be one of the teams fighting for one of the hotly contested playoff spots out of District 16A. They're flying under the radar a little bit, but with an experienced QB and Luke Lomely at East Lake must be accounted for. I think the expectations for us are always the same. You know, our community expects us to be playing in week 11 or, or first week of the playoffs. Uh, maybe a lot of people won't give us as much credit as they have in the past, I think, but the tradition, the guys that we have coming back has something to say. I think because a lot of us now probably didn't start last year, you know, the young class 25s, maybe seniors that didn't play last year as juniors, and, you know, we're all just hungry. You know, we all have something to prove, and, you know, we're just going to go out there and give everybody our best shot. I don't know how they'll be this year, but Luke has the best mullet, so they win. Eastlake opens the season on the road on next Friday at Andrus at 7 p.m. That's also the first night of the Borderlands' most complete high school football wrap-up show, 9 Overtime. Tune in for the season premiere of 9 OT at 10:15 August 25th with myself, Sam Guzman, Ed Stansbury, Jason Flores, and Andy Morton.